matchday reviews. It's East FC. Let's go do it. Hi, all. welcome back to a new video on the channel. Today we're doing Matchday Reviews, Eastleigh FC edition. We're heading off to the Silver Lake Stadium tomorrow morning where we're going to be watching Eastleigh FC take on Hartlepool. Matchday Reviews is a newer series on the channel where I'm going to be heading to as many stadiums as I possibly can that I've never done before, ticking them off my list at the moment. I've done 40 stadiums across 92 games and you're coming with me for number 41. The only thing I like to think that I'm doing different to other YouTubers out there is where I can get tickets, I'm going to be trying to do it as a way fans perspective. So tomorrow we will be going in the Hartlepool end where over a year ago I actually went to watch Sutton Hartlepool and ended up in the Hartlepool way end there. So uh, I'm a diehard. No, no, not really. Cut, cut that out. Eastleigh FC, they currently sit 18th in the National League, three points off relegation, or only one win in their last five, so a big game for them today. Hartlepool, on the other hand, they do sit 13th in the table. They are only two points in front of Eastleigh, though, which is crazy considering their table position difference. But that being said, Hartlepool, two wins in their last five. It's going to be an incredibly close game. It is non-league day as well. Really, really looking forward to it. Let's stop waffling. Let's get out there and have some fun. Hartlepool away, mate. Hartlepool away, need a lift. <laughs> on our way, we'll get some predictions. I don't know how many Hartlepool are going to bring. They have got a 10 hour round trip today they and they're only mid table. They got but three here. They got, they got three extra fans today, so we're going to get some predictions. Uh, the only other thing I'll say is the Premier League trophy is in attendance at Eastleigh today because uh, when Numpty's gone in the away and we probably won't be able to see it. Liverpool but uh, let's, uh, the season. Yeah, let's get some predictions. I'll be the driver today. Predictions, fella? I want goals. I'm going two all. Two all. Ooh, two I'll take that. James, prediction, fella. It's only my second time watching my favourite team ever. The Stags. <laughs> Can't wait. Can't wait. Uh, we lost two 0 at was it Sutton last Sutton, time? Yeah. We went. Lost two 0 at Sutton. So um, we're going to redeem ourselves today, and I'm going to go for a three-one Hartlepool win. Wow. Come on the pool. Fortunately, I'm following the footsteps, Harvey. I'm going pretty boring. I'm going for a one-one draw. Anyway, we've got about an hour and thirty-minute drive. See you there. It's time to... We're about a five minute walk away. Does anyone have high expectations of today, I suppose, is the question? Anyone really excited? What do you mean? Uh, yeah, buzzing. Good. Well, what do you mean? I get to watch my favourite team ever play. <laughs> I don't know what you're on about. Oh, this man is not buzzing, mate. He can't have a beer. Not excited. <laughs> First impressions, um, not too bad. It's not massive for National League. It's it's okay though, isn't it? I don't know. I, I, honestly, I just think it looks quite appealing on the eye. Like walking in, it just looks like a nice setup. Yeah, it's nothing special though, is it? No. But it's nice enough. Should we go have a look inside? Why not? Yeah. So far, pretty friendly fans. Nice looking ground. I just think it's time to get in there and have a pint and a bit of grub. Do a bit of a food tasting review, eh? Oh, no, we don't have to. Yeah, we do have to, mate. Uh, mate, pitch looks like a carpet. It does look nice. Mate, I'd, I actually, I think it's quite nice. It's a nice setup. Yeah, if they just had a, like another stand around there, it'd be a proper yeah, nice Yeah, yeah, but I don't mind um, it. I think it's nice. Yeah. I think it's really nice. Yeah, I mean, it wouldn't look out of place in a, in a League 1 League or 2. League 1 or 2, no, not necessarily. But yeah. no, I'm pretty pleased with it. A few Hartlepool fans made yeah, the trip, clearly. The, the, well, I'm, we're, I'm here as well. So you're, you're here, I've mate. Cool shot. Trip. So, yeah, we're going to have a bit of a further investigation. Yeah. Up or thumbs down, mate. <laughs> Away and refreshments, mate. Slightly depressing around here, isn't it? Oh, mate. If you want to get down in the dumps and you're feeling sorry for yourself, come here and you'll want to finish yourself. <laughs> Look at this. Hey, that's side day. How, how much did you think these two cost? I would have thought eight pound. Eight pound. Five pound. Two. Buy one, get buy one, get one. Bog off. Bog off, Tracy hey, Baker. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Number 36, Courtney Numbers. Number 41, Shay Cooper. Mate, 
and the away attendance is way better than I thought. It is for, it, for a 10 hour round trip, the away attendance is fantastic. Yeah, I mean, for me it was only 3 hours, but it was Wow, I know. in the shade here mate aren't we the other side of the pitch looks lovely and sunny one of the, very chilly mate i am very chilly this coat will not be coming off mate. no That sky is looking a tad dodgy. Not liking the look of that sky. Do you see any blue in that, mate? Uh-oh. I felt raindrops on my head. Wow. Not nice. <laughs> Inside access. Oh, We're in one of the turnstiles. Oh, oh no. Got the Wi-Fi right at the back somewhere. Yeah, take a uh, yeah. yeah, mate, I got my ticket in my pocket. Let's all just Question of the day, have you ever done a food review in a turnstile at Eastleigh versus Hartley Four Way? Yeah. I've have you ever it. done that? Yeah, I've done it once before. No burgers, just sausage rolls. A oh, sausage yeah. roll's quite nice, but... No, it's not. £3.50 for a sausage roll is spenny. It's dry as hell. It's absolutely tipping it down. No burgers available. Um, I don't know. The, the away there hasn't felt quite so amazing thus oh, far. Yeah. This is literally where we are, no way in. Bosch? No. No, okay. Oh, no. Second half has kicked off. Would have been lovely if um, it didn't hammer it down so badly. Down, it's fucking down. <laughs> Mate, it's good the sun's back out. Second half's kicked off. First half was relatively boring and slow, wasn't it? Um, so look, hoping the sun's back out now. Let's hope for a good half of football. Yeah. Yeah, I'd like a good half of football. I'm quite pissed now. I don't want to be rude, mate, but it's quiet, isn't it? It's yeah. really quiet. Like, it's really quiet. I know they're 1-0 down, so you can't be too horrible. But it is quiet, isn't it? We're both distracted. No, Shot bad ball. ball. Um, yeah, I mean, it started the same as it was second half. Uh, first half, even, sorry. It's, it, it was quiet at first half. It's quiet the second half. Sorry, Eastie fans, but you ain't got much, I'm afraid. Sorry.
Yeah. One one mate. Penalty or not, I didn't see it. I have no idea, but there was Too no, far away. there was no complaints. No, so no, no. Yeah, one one. Game. My prediction is on. It's one one. About ten minutes to go. Could go anywhere now, couldn't it? Two goals for Hartlepool, three-one win. There you go. Right, that's finished. Eastley one, Hartlepool one. We're gonna go around, get a bit of a a score out of ten for what everyone thought of that match day prediction. Um, right, let's just do it. Harvey, out of 10, mate. Five. Five? Wow. Poor atmosphere. Yeah. No cheeseburgers. No cheeseburgers. No cheeseburgers at a football ground. And the football overall is just rubbish as well. So yeah, five for me. Five. James, out of 10. Three. Three? Three, I'm going three. Wow. I'm going three. Um, firstly, for Eastley fans, they're in a relegation battle and they can't make any noise at all. So I'm just going to put that out there. Um, secondly, the away the away section is shocking. Like there's no facilities at all, so that's boring. Um, but I think we did come out a bad day. So I think the weather was horrible. So that put me in a horrible mood. Um, but yeah, overall we're free. Unless it's your team, I wouldn't bother. So that ends with me. Uh, I'm probably going to be the kindest of them. Maybe because I've run the channel. I'm going to go 6 out of 10. I think the stadium was quite nice. I think some of the fans we met were quite nice. I think the drinks were reasonable prices. The fact that we got two Carlsbergs for £5 is an absolute bargain. It's not I, I, good I, enough! I, I do agree. The food probably wasn't good enough. The away end was slightly shambolic. And overall, the atmosphere wasn't great. But to give it anything over a six seems criminal. So look. Seems kind. So kind, thank you. So look, Eastley FC match day review has been done and dusted. Let us know in the comments who you want to see us do next. And until the next one, boys, you've bottled it. You've uh, bottled it. Silly boy, you've bottled it. See you later.